After more than 36 hours, Little Cottonwood Canyon is opened back up this morning by UDOT. Folks waiting hours to make it up the canyon for the holiday. The specialist Brianna Chavez spoke to skiers and boarders alike, getting the chance to enjoy that fresh snow earlier today. A beautiful sunny day for skiers and snowboarders. I just like the view. That's my favorite part. The serenity of just being up there in the mountains is really beautiful. Jefferson Zia and his dad Joe, two of hundreds enjoying the fresh snow. I like to support him. He's a big snowboarder. A lot of powdery snow. That wasn't the case just a few hours before. Honestly, we didn't know about the the closures or anything. Up to six feet of snow over the last seven days for Snowbird. UDOT shutting down Little Cottonwood Canyon from Saturday night to Monday morning due to high avalanche danger. It would wake me up, but I got used to it. Open in the courtyard. Forcing people to interlodge like Cameron Dickerson visiting from Los Angeles. Surrounded by all my family, it made it a lot easier. Hundreds of people waiting for hours to get up the canyon. Traffic moving smoothly, not just on the roads, but on the lifts too. Waiting in line for the bridge to open, it was a little bit of a hassle, like wondering if it's going to open. Only a few lifts open for the day as Snowbird experienced wind gusts of over 100 miles per hour. Everybody is out there doing what they can to try to get the mountain open for our guests. Riley Whitney with Snowbird says safety is always top of mind. We always want to get folks out on the mountain, but the reality of a big storm is we're going to do what we can. And when conditions don't allow us to open lifts and terrain, you know, we're going to make that decision. But it was just enough for people to enjoy before the holiday weekend ends. Be able to have fun with my family. And other resorts were also dealing with strong winds this morning, which caused some delays and limited the number of lifts that were able to open today. Snowbird tells me that they're going to be working on more avalanche mitigation and are hoping to open more lifts tomorrow. At Little Cottonwood Canyon, Brianna Travis, KSL 5 News.